Hello everyone, Shopper Gaming here, welcome back to my channel. It have been a month since I started playing the game, and today I will be telling you the honest review and my honest opinion about the game, since I have been actually playing it and not just trying it out for a day or two. And going to the VIP, you're gonna see exactly that I have been playing it, well, it's even over a month. So, today is my actual and honest review to the game, I'm totally completely free player and the game to be honest is 100% free to play friendly. If we check out all the things like as an example the event tabs, if we just look at it, you will be thinking that oh look it's a lot of pay events. Well let us be honest over here. All type of games is actually if we look to all the events in it, it's including a lot of pay to win that you need to be paying for something to be getting it but the difference in mecha domination that actually most of the things if not all of it you're actually able to get it without actually being needing to be paying anything like as an example here the vip in most of the games you need to be actually spending a lot of money to be able to get into a high rank vip Right now it have been already a month and I'm already VIB 6 and um, I'm already half the way to be going to VIB 7. And that's because the game is giving you option to be buying VIB points or experience for the VIP with the diamonds you're collecting. And collecting diamonds is not really that big issue. You have so much resources to be getting diamonds from. If we go to the events as an example... We have over here these boxes its resources but if we check in this one here the training treasure hunt this one here you collect from it this epic hunt treasure and this one is actually including diamonds in it and by as an example doing the purple one i'm going to be getting six boxes it's yes having a not really big chance for diamonds but it's still possible to be getting it and not only that, the same when you assist your uh, guild members, friends, you will be getting this box as well. And even you can be getting the orange one too by just assisting. And you're going to have a chance to even get a thousand diamonds. So this is not a big issue to be actually getting the VIP. And at the same time, the game is like any other game, having the alliance to be getting your guild and having a helping hand from other friends and your guild members and well to be honest here it's the same style like any other strategy game but the unique over here with mecha domination is that the game is actually a bit not really a bit it's a lot free to play friendly you're able to get a lot of resources and a lot of things that you can be achieving it faster with the bay but still you're actually able to get it all you have to do is just to be planning like mm, as an example for now we have some new beasts have just released i'm trying to find this one here mm, i think it's mm. well we can take as an example the memory of civil, uh, civilization event i have made a video for that one talking about it and this one it's a skin gonna be adding 2% extra attack to all your troops. It's not hard to get it. All you have to do if you have in diamonds to be just using it wisely and you can be reaching top 10 and you're gonna get this skin permanently. Or you can just skip it and just save your resources to be actually able to get another skin later on and maybe it will be even better than this one. So everything is actually possible to be getting in this game. At the same time, the piece that is making the game different from any other type of strategy game is that they are having the mechanical type where you have in the, the troops, leaders, the piece as the mechanical monsters to be controlling. We have over here the Scorcher. He's the type like mm, the mammals, but as an electronic one, as a piece, mechanical one. It's really a great addition and it's not really hard to be working on improving these ones. You have the quick hunt to be collecting the coins to be making summons for them as well as you have a chance to get an ssr piece from here the caesar and at the same time not only that we have an as well the store here 
where you can be collecting to be getting the piece. We have the piece parts here where you can be getting all others and it's all obtainable from the events like this one here have just released today and that one it is available in one of the events. I'm just getting loose between all this. Yes, it's over here, the Ace Commander. This one here, we are able to get this one from the Rankin. Like you check, they are having, well, at least you need 10 to be able to get this beast. And if we check here, you are actually getting fragments from it. And not only this part, but also there is another event where you can be, like we have here the beast market. This one here, by making your uh, daily activity reaching a certain points, you are actually getting one of the black market tokens for free to be trying out to be collecting these fragments. And honestly, I have collected one of my pieces from this one. It's over here, this piece here, the death way. That one, I have collected it from this type of event. And really, I did not spend a single dollar. And just look into it right now, it's already, I got three copies of it. You can be finding out from the Evolve over here, the store. So everything around the game is really obtainable with no issues. The only thing you need to actually have a bit of a planning to be using your resources. And all I say, the game is seriously just feels perfect. They are more than free to play friendly. Well, yeah, for the pay to win option, it's available in any type of games because to be honest, all type of developers, they are in need of actually having the pay options because they are making these games for actually making profit and not just like making it completely for free and wasting their time. So to be honest here, they need to be having this option. If you don't want to be making any power cases, it's your option, but it's totally completely like they are making a replacement for this part. It's not telling you like, ah, uh, you have to be paying for this one to be able to get it. They are giving you everything for free over here. All you have to do is just plan. And it's not really hard to be finding ways in this game. As well as the pieces, most of them, you're able to actually get them from the wild, from the start. You can be just making troops and march towards any type of piece. And you can be collecting these fragments and even the complete piece itself. Like... We have option here for auto capture and this one it's not available in any type of strategy games you can be using a making a marsh as an example this one you can be putting the pieces to be selecting them and then to be putting the troops and it will be just go marsh all over the place for the amount of levels uh, for the level you want as well as the amount of attempts so that's something really good that's the one of the unique things about the game itself the same time you have as well the search feature. You can be uh, searching for the piece to layer, the piece itself, the piece to have. And this one, it's like a counterattack when you get your pace attacked by all these beasts. And you're getting a lot of rewards, including diamonds, experience for the beasts to be leveling them up. On the same time, it really just feels so great, to be honest. Like, as an example, I have just attacked this one. And boom, in just a few seconds, this one have got killed. Yep, we're going to be attacking it and then just take a big pike and boom, this one is dead. And not only that, we got a reward as well. We got the rewards over here. So really, it just feels great. All these diamonds I got for free, as well as if we check even the backpack, I got a lot, a lot, a lot of resources over here too. So really, the game is worth completely the time you're going to be consuming in it and playing it out. Give it a try, make sure to actually play it and not just download it and uh, try it for a day or such. Give it a time, download it, play it for a few days. And if you want to play it for uh, on your computer, like how I'm doing right now, I'll leave to you in the description a link to download the emulator I'm using. It's making the game perfectly smooth and clear and it's completely for free. And you can just make multiple of it to be able to play the game on different accounts and it's really great to do so so that's all guys for this video and my complete honest review to the game after i've been playing it for over a month 
and I'm being 100% honest, that's my opinion as a player and not as a content creator to the game or any kind of things. I'm not getting paid to be saying all this, I'm saying it completely from my own will. So that's all, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of my videos in the future. See you all with another video, till then take care and make sure to actually give the game a good try.